At the stroke of the midnight hour, when the world sleeps, India will awake to life and freedom. These were the words from Free India's first Prime Minister, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru's powerful speech on the midnight of August 15, 1947, which highlighted the victory of India's non-violent struggle against the British rule and which still reverberates and evokes one's patriotic sentiments. Namaste and good morning to one and all. Today, on August 15, 2020, our country completes 73 years of attaining independence and our school too is joining in these celebrations with the rest of the country. To begin with, let's watch our principal Srimati E. Parvati hoist the tricolor. Namaste. Jai Jawan. I tell this to a nine-year-old princess, daughter of a martyr. Somewhere in another world, they needed a hero. They chose Dada because he was the best. And that world, unlike ours, is a paradise. Now, low and oak, hold your head high, for Dada is watching you from heaven. And won't you lift, gift him with a smile that will make him proud? She gave her best smiles ever and stood still to the rhymes of Janaganamana. Well, my dear children and colleagues, it's that time of the year when patriotism runs high among us Indians. It's a time of national pride, the Tiranga and the anthem giving goosebumps. It's that time when we seem to suddenly remember our soldiers who fell in the line of duty. Salutes to the gallant sacrifices. Men of valor, you gave your lives for us. As you adorn the sky stars, we take a bow. Fellow Indians, as we mark our 74th Independence Day, let us pledge not to limit patriotism to twice a year. Let us be proud Indians every day. Remember those unknown and known soldiers every day who selflessly let go. Let us remember their mothers, widows, daughters, sons and fathers who gifted us our smiles and chose to hide a tear. 
The land is so barren and the pass is so high that only the best of friends and fiercest of enemies come by. Thus is a local saying in Siachen, Malaysia. One place where fewer soldiers have died on the line duty due to enemy fire than because of the harsh weather conditions, the highest combat zone on planet Earth. None but these men, dead or alive, deserve our salutes on this day and every day. Let us all take a vow to become self-reliant, supportive and work for an Atmanar Bhar Bharat. Jai Hind. Next, we'll have Divya Miss from the Social Science Department deliver the Independence Day message. Let me begin with the quote of Nelson Mandela. For to be free is not merely to cast off one's chains, but to live in a way that respects and enhances the freedom of others. Namaste. August 15 holds a special place in the heart of Indians, as it was on this day in 1947 that we got freedom from British rule. The freedom fighters of India played an extensive role in getting independence for the country. They fought hard for our country in many different ways. And these heroes are remembered even today for their deeds. The hardship they faced and the sacrifices they made led to the freedom of our country. It has been almost seven decades since India gained independence. And the country has progressed at a fast pace. The nation has been growing economically and socially and is heading towards development. If these freedom fighters had not contributed in the freedom struggle, the current situation of the country would have been different. Let us not forget the selfless acts of various freedom fighters who fought for our country and contributed in making India one of the largest democracies in the world and the best example of unity and diversity. The future progress and development of our country do not depend solely on technological developments, but on how we build social cohesion and trust between our nation and its people. Let us continue building a great nation we can all rely on and be proud of. This can be achieved if we are honest towards our duties and by respecting everyone. We should sincerely perform our duties and work hard. We should be responsible and very educated citizens of India. It is the responsibility of every citizen of India to lead our country ahead and make it the best country in the world. Now we are under COVID-19 pandemic. All of us know that it's a global crisis and the biggest challenge we have faced in our life. Let us not forget the selfless service and dedicated work of our Corona warriors, who have risked their lives in an effort to keep people safe from the virus. I would like to conclude by borrowing the words of Aung San Suu Kyi. The only real prison is fear, and the only real freedom is freedom from fear. Thank you. Stay home, stay safe, and stay healthy. Jai Hind. Thank you, Miss. Emotions are well expressed through music. Let us now listen to the rendition of a patriotic song by the students of our school. Vande Mataram Vande Mataram Vande Mataram 
भासिनी सुमधुर भाषिणी Rima ma ga ri ra ri ma ma ba ri ma ba ni ga ni ba da ma ba ri ma ba ni ma ba ni ma ba ma ba ni ga ni ni sa ga ri ma ni sa ni sa ba ni sa ni ni sa 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 ni ni sa 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 ni ni ri 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 ni ni sa 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 ni sa ri ma ba ni ni sa sa ni da ba ba da ma ga ri ma ga ni ni sa koti koti ganda kala kala ni na da kara le koti koti khujendru da kar kar. धर्म तुम्हें मर्म watch a video which is a tribute to all the soldiers guarding our country
On this occasion of celebrating 73 years of being an independent nation, our country is grappling with yet another enemy, the COVID pandemic. Let us all take a moment to acknowledge the efforts of our valiant warriors who are fighting this war. The doctors, nurses, health workers, policemen and everybody else who are putting their lives on the line to make sure that our country is back on track soon. The government of India has invited these warriors from around the country to be a part of the Independence Day Parade and celebrations being held at Red for today. Just as we salute the soldiers guarding our country, today we salute these warriors who are inside the boundary and waging a war against the pandemic that has taken over the world. Stay home, stay safe. Jai Hind.